subscribe and ring the bell to never miss an update. Hello everyone. Today on Lady Mary Bath, I'm taking you inside a hidden gym in the Dallas area, B&B Consignment. It's located on Coit Road in Richardson. This shop is full of fashion, furniture, home decor, and tabletop treasures. Join me. I'm excited to take you inside B&B &B Consignment. They have been in the Promenade Center for 44 years. They were originally Baubles and Beads Resale. Their mission is to offer savings, service, and selection with a wonderful shopping experience. Lots of treasures to discover here today. Welcome to B&B &B Consignment. We're going to have lots of fun today shopping for fashion, furniture, home decor, and tabletop treasures. We will have some fun with fashion today. And when I'm looking for a new handbag, I always turn to a consignment store first because they have top quality and the prices are usually amazing, sometimes even new with tags. And I'm already recognizing some top brands and I can't wait to discover the deals here today. B&B is a fashion destination. You can find some top brands and they generally price at half of retail. And all of these items are either new with tags or gently used. And this, for example, is a Michael Kors for $99. Isn't that a fashion statement? And they also have some top brands such as Consuela and Patricia Nash. This is a great piece right here. It is hand tooled, it is $149. And this is a nice neutral pewter that will go with anything. Brahmin is a beautiful and quality handbag. Their products are designed in Massachusetts using luxury leathers from Italy and around the globe. And these definitely hold up and are fantastic accessories. Consuela is a brand from my neck of the woods and very popular here in the South. Lots of detail and they're actually quite user friendly. I'll give you a look at the inside. New with tags is always a great find for $55. Look at this DKNY bag. And it's originally $168 from DKNY. This would be an all-purpose bag. Also great for traveling, that quilted look and quite modern. And I do like contemporary handbags as well. Can really update your outfit. And Consuela is a Houston designer. And here is the signature patch. She also has vinyl coated interior, which makes it very user friendly. Consignment shopping is a great idea for vintage fashion accessories. You never know what you'll find here at B&B. And this handbag, I think, would even work well in a centerpiece. $55. It's a great price for this mid-century treasure. And you will notice the mushroom design. That was actually quite a decorative element that was not only for fashion, but home decor, including in lighting wear. A mid-century fashion statement with this wooden box handbag. These were quite popular in the 60s and early 70s. The ladies would often hand paint them. I remember the oblong shape that was more of a wooden basket weave. This one is extra special, $55, and it even has an embellishment on the interior and it is cloth lined. Wouldn't that be a fun talking point to carry this to a ladies luncheon? Now we will peek into the home furnishings and tabletop area of the store. Lots to discover here, some quality pieces with great prices. And I would certainly encourage you to shop your local consignment store before going to a retail or box store. There's some fantastic tabletop brands represented in this store. And of course, my favorite is Waterford Crystal. 
This is a very special toasting flute, one that I haven't seen in person before, at least I don't recall having seen it, and it is the Millennium all in one. Originally the flutes were a pair of love, happiness, peace, prosperity, and health. And here we have all the motifs in one glass. And even more special, it is signed by my friend Jim O'Leary in year 2000. This is something that I will definitely take home today. It has a colored sticker on it. That means it is half price of $45. For $22.50, this is my find of the day. Here's another look at that flute. And you will also notice the number one stem pattern in the world across all of tabletop. There are two reasons you should look for Waterford Crystal when you are consignment shopping. One, they are quite expensive, $105 each for the Lismore. And two, you don't get the quality today that we had back then, even in the 80s and 90s. It is definitely much better than you find today. And this is the Lismore Claret, the number one stem pattern in all of the world across tabletop, was designed by Miroslav Havel for Waterford Crystal. He was a Czech artisan that came over to Ireland. The Lismore Highball is a versatile glass. It can segue from orange juice at brunch to iced tea at lunch. Think pink with an addition to your tabletop collection with modern or vintage. These pretty and pink etched glasses, I can even see for a dessert. It's not only for a beverage, and you could even do a layered mini trifle, and one price for the whole set of seven. A set of seven glasses from the Depression era. This is elegant glass. Wonderful way to elevate your table settings. $28. You cannot go anywhere retail and find something of this quality and style. For a more modern table, perhaps you might enjoy these oversized, hand-blown glasses. It is the Artland brand, and they're very well priced for this extensive set of 12 glasses, $134. This is quite an extensive set of the Libby Glass Company silver leaf pattern. We have highballs, tumblers, single old fashions, and barware has become increasingly popular with more home entertaining, and that colored sticker means that it's half price. Another great find in the store today from Miller-Ragasca, the Galia patterned champagne flutes. These are half price, $128 for the set of six. This is a retired pattern that is selling for $118 a piece on replacements. A company started by Mr. Miller, who had been the North American distributor for Waterford Crystal for years. He started his own company operating out of Yugoslavia. These are true beauties and perfect for celebrations. You will notice the detail even in the stem. That's something that you do not find today in modern day patterns. And some wonderful barware pieces, very well priced, and a mid-century find in this amber color. That's something that would go with many different styles and seasons. Remember to always look down when you're out at a consignment shop. You might find something wonderful. The vintage Madeira Tiffin Franciscan glasses were quite popular in the 1970s. $165 for a set of 20 glasses. That's a very good price for these vintage beauties. I grew up with these in a green, and once you fill them with ice, they are quite heavy, especially when you're a child. And these are definitely vintage chic. A secretary is a wonderful piece of furniture that you can incorporate into a living room office or even a powder room with extra towels and toiletries. You would be amazed at the ways in which you can incorporate this piece into your home. And of course, you can display collections and one of my very favorite tabletop essentials. An antique secretary is a great idea for housing a collection or for your home office to stay organized, have a spot that doesn't take up too much space in your home. And this insert is actually removable. It pulls out. Great for organizing. This is quite a good deal at $515. And here we even have a secret compartment. You could stow something away. A wonderful variety of rose bowls. I use mine for anything from toothbrushes, tissues, to, of course, floral arrangements. And I like that they are low to the table. It does not obstruct the view from the person seated across from you. I especially like this footed one with a hob star that is European. 
And there's another one that looks quite familiar to me. I'm going to turn it over and look for a back stamp. And there is an acid etched logo. Do you see it? This sweet and petite rose bowl definitely piques my interest. You will notice that laurel leaf pattern. It is the Glandor from Waterford Crystal. And those beautiful diamond cuts, well priced at $28. And I found the back stamp right here. And here we have a statement piece. This is something that would elevate your home. And that's what I love about consignment shopping is that you find things from all walks of life and of course, different eras. And this is a spectacular showpiece. This is a beautiful rendered sculpture of a Greco-Roman fairy in that rich bronze patina. It is offered on a black polished marble base and they call them stand. And that would be interesting for your entryway or even office. It's offered at half the retail price, $2,499. Let's step into this inviting living space. My eye is drawn to that pop of color of that orange pillow on this taupe sofa. And it happens to be an Ethan Allen, $457.50 at half price. You could take this in so many different directions with throw pillows. And that is a fantastic piece and price. And I like the chairs with it too. And you get some ideas of how you could take this in so many different directions. This dining set is from the Saloom Company, which is based in central Massachusetts in the Hardwood Forest area. And at $18.99, it is a very good price, considering some of the chairs can be as much as seven and $800. This is that beautiful fan back design with the sand finish. American craftsmanship at its finest. I like that this is made in the USA. And I enjoy learning about the history of furniture companies. It gives you a lot more respect for their work. And that would be perfect for a breakfast room. This is an interesting and well-priced leather desk by Kara Mann. And she is known for having a grounded style with a bit of relaxed glamor. The Wall Street Journal has dubbed her a spark plug in the world of design. When you're shopping for furniture, one tip in looking for the manufacturer's tag, label, or stamp is to open up a drawer. And if it happens to be a chest of drawers, you will find it on the back, and a sofa would be on the underside. And here we have this beautiful brass plate that is inside this caraman piece. Another great option if you're looking to furnish a home office. And there we have a masculine touch with this wing back chair. This curved desk by Sly is a blend of form and function. It is well priced at $899 and you'll see the leather inserts, quite a nice look for your home office. It is a company that is now owned by Lexington Home Brands. And with the addition of this plaid wing back chair, it gives a nice Ralph Lauren look. Light up your space with an artistic element. Here we have two great options. This one has a geode, it's incorporated with stone and wood, and it is priced at $515. And that would be an interesting addition to even a modern decor. And the smaller one I like with the agate and that addition of copper makes it so interesting. It's $415. And you just never know what you'll find here. They also had a mummy statue from Monte Carlo. And that is the neat thing about their consigners is they perhaps have even lived all over the world and bring some interesting things to the table. And here we have a familiar pattern. The Spode Blue Room collection is named after a display room at the Spode factory where the archival blue and white patterns are exhibited. And there are many different types of plates in the collection, anything from flora and fauna to famous landmarks. And it's actually highly collected. And these are, of course, transferware based on hand engraved copper prints. Here's an example of a floral plate. And these can certainly be used for serving. It could be a dinner plate. It does not have to just be used as a collection. And anything with a colored sticker is half off. 
at $9, that is a steal. This large oversized platter is a steal, half price for $14. It is the Woodman design, also based on a copper engraved print from the Spode Blue Room collection. It was first introduced in 1816, and this is almost like a piece of history. It's a walk through the garden with these wonderful plants. Wouldn't that be a fantastic gift for a friend instead of sending fresh flowers? It would be something a bit more lasting. And these are actually interesting decorative elements. And they were popular in the mid-century. I'm liking those cherry blossoms. Mid-century fun with these jade trees. They're in celadon pots and they are made of glass. This one is priced at $55. And you could place these as a centerpiece for an Asian-inspired look or for perhaps even something for spring. One of the many benefits of consignment shopping is that someone else has carefully procured this collection over time and you have a wonderful selection. And now we'll take a look at something that is quite masculine, an item that does very well for me in charity auctions. We've got all our ducks in a row. They are hand carved and hand painted and very well priced. And this one here is $28. And now we're going to take a look at a very familiar glass pattern. The American line from Fostoria, which was at one time the largest maker of handmade glassware in the United States. This is priced at $135 for a centerpiece bowl. You could fill that with fruit, florals, or even punch. It's the most successful pattern in the history of glass making. You're probably familiar with Linux Eternal. This is the platinum version. It is solitaire from their Dimension collection. Quite a classic look. And Tiffany and Company. Here we've got their bamboo design. Really like this plate. It's half price. Pyrex is highly collectible. There are those pieces that can even go for as much as $1,000 if they're rare or perhaps they were even misprints. I'm liking this green color. That's an all-purpose mixing bowl. It is $95. And that would have been part of a nesting set. From the Jeanette Glass Company, we have the Iris Herringbone pattern in a carnival glass. Look at that luster. And these are very well priced. And the ice beverages, you could use these for just about anything from lemonade to a luscious dessert. And they are half price today. You will see the color sticker and that brings it down to $27.50 for a set of six. A wonderful wall of China. You never know what you'll find here at B&B. My daughter popped in two years ago for the first time and found a pattern that she knew I would love. She reached me virtually, I was out of state, gave me a tour of the shop, and I made a purchase of the Heinrich & Company Grand Duchess pattern. You might recall from a previous segment where I created a spring table inspired by this pattern featuring floral sprays, a yellow band, and gilt edge. And I'm thrilled to have acquired this for $75, eight play settings, and serving pieces. I encourage you to take a look at that segment where I feature this find from B&B Consignment. This is a dreamy Wedgwood pattern. I would love to add this to my collection. If you have this, I would like to hear from you in the comments below. I think it is one of the most beautiful that Wedgwood has made. The colors are soothing. The raised design is stunning. This is quite an extensive collection of the Wedgwood Queensware, and it is the applied white on blue, which is harder to find. I'm just amazed at how many pieces they have, including salt and pepper shakers, compotes, and if you are a collector, this is definitely a find. It's certainly special with the serving pieces, and not everyone would have the matching salt and pepper shakers or compote, and this is a great opportunity to buy a truly complete set, 1,265 for 12 play settings and all the extra pieces. And this is a pattern, of course, with an amazing history. 
You'll notice the back stamp on this beautiful Queensware is Wedgwood of Etruria and Barliston. Etruria was a factory town that Josiah opened in 1769 and it ran for 180 years in the Staffordshire area, Stoke-on-Trent. Josiah Wedgwood was one of the first potters to mark its products with the name, and we are grateful for those back stamps. Here is an example of the reverse. It is the white Queensware with the applied blue grape leaves. And Queensware was created for Queen Charlotte, the consort to King George III. She placed a large order for a tea set and later a coffee set. And we still have some examples of this today. Here's a wonderful mid-century pattern with platinum and a wonderful embellishment, $374. And this was very popular in the 1960s. Quite a wonderful look with that touch of pink. Let's look at the back stamp. It is Syracuse China Made in America in the coronet pattern. It has a regal look to it. And I can see this for fancy dinners or Sunday brunch. And this pattern is $300. It looks like Noritake with that finial. Another extensive collection with the floral pattern. Let's take a look at the back stamp. Love that inner gold rim. It is Citadel China, the Ashworth pattern with that regal castle back stamp. 75% off of $240. Let's take a look at this Mikasa pattern. Ultra modern and magnificent. You could certainly stretch this with a white dish pattern, even one with a gold rim, or even black plates, if that's something you have. I quite like this. And it is the Geometry Gold from Mikasa. Lots of chinoiserie represented in the store today, and here's a sampling of that. And this fish is catching my eye. You might remember an episode where I featured the history of chinoiserie and then I share a table. $66 for this fish vase and I have a similar item on my buffet that I shared with you. So take a look at that segment and you can learn more about the chinoiserie. And of course blue and white blends beautifully with it. And chinoiserie is in various colors. It's not all about the blue and white. It just happens to be my favorite. And some great transfer wear. I like that bunny. And on the back side, we will find another familiar pattern. The blue willow. And I am thinking that some of you might have this pattern in your collection. I would love to hear from you and the favorite color you use in showcasing your pattern on tables. I like the shape of that teacup. And you can certainly mix the blue willow from different manufacturers. It doesn't have to be just one. And the square plates are really fun too. 515 for the entire set. And here's a closer look at this iconic design with a Johnson Brothers England back stamp. Blue Willow is a distinctive and elaborate chinoiserie pattern. And it was created at a time when China was mass produced with transfer wear. In 1790, Spode came out with Blue Willow and also Johnson Brothers. It is the number one pattern in tabletop simply because it was made by so many different factories beginning at the end of the 18th century. A contemporary look with a traditional sofa. You'll see how all of these elements come together for an eclectic mix. Well priced at $315. Always a great idea to shop the secondary market for furniture, especially if you're setting up a kid, maybe a college apartment or your first home. For $315, you can have an ivory sofa that's in great condition. Add some throw pillows for $35 and you've already furnished your room. A Waterford crystal bowl and you'll see it has the original Waterford sticker priced at $125. I know many of you leave the Waterford sticker on and if you're enjoying it in your home or serving with it, I encourage you to remove that sticker. If you're giving it as a gift, you want to leave it on. And there are also some older pieces of Waterford we will discover here. 
So many great tabletop essentials, including pitchers. You see the notched rim on that one. There's a Waterford Crystal Lismore right there on the right. And here we have one that is sort of a replica from a museum piece. $69 is a very good price on this. It's got strawberry cuts and fan cuts along the rim. And this Waterford vase with that laurel leaf and diamond cut design, $25. Great price. With the 16 cuts on the bottom that we all recognize. And this is based on one of their museum pieces. You'll see it has an elongated handle on this creamer and quite an interesting piece. $66, and that would have been probably four times originally. Definitely some hidden gems here and very familiar patterns and brands. $28 for this Waterford Crystal Creamer. And that's a piece that can stand alone. Of course, there was a sugar bowl with it originally. And the Heart Hand Cooler, $25. That was $50 retail back in the 90s. And it came in several colors. And they have some Yadro, Lalique. So many top brands here. And Costa Boda. That's the art line from Orifer's Swedish Crystal. And it's a bit of a whimsical look. And these are, of course, highly collectible. And you can find all that information on the back stamp. $65. And the snowman is sweet, too. That would be a nice addition to your holiday table. So many great finds in this area. There's so much to see here at B&B &B Consignment. Make sure you walk around the store twice, look up, down, all around, and you might discover another hidden gem. Let me show you. I'm wondering if this is a pattern that you might recognize or even have in your collection. One of the oldest, and you'll see those olive cuts. And I bet that you know exactly the pattern, and it does not have the 16 cuts on the bottom. Certain patterns do not. And you see that acid etched stamp. A set of four Waterford Crystal Colleen single old fashions for $35. 75% off definitely gets my attention. Heise Glass is a company that started in 1914. If you'd like to know more about it, take a look at the Houston Glass Show segment where we talk with Max Miller, a glass expert, and we learn more about this fantastic company and the history of American glassware. A nice selection of Heise, known as American Crystal. This is part of a 350 piece collection that was consigned by a family with close ties to the Heise history. And of course, that H inside of a diamond is the logo you want to look for. And Heise is a very interesting company. And they were eventually bought by Imperial Glass. Most of their molds were sold to Heise societies. They were actually the first to advertise in national magazines starting in 1910. I see a familiar Heise pattern there. And of course, they are also known for the clear. And the particular pattern here is Lariat. And this would have been a mayonnaise dish, $28 for the bowl. And the underplate is well priced at $13 and remember less 75% off. And this would be great for serving scones, cookies, or as an underplate. And the interesting square based glasses here are called Carcassonne and they are in the Sahara yellow absolutely gorgeous shade. I tend to collect more of the pink and the green and this console bowl might just fit a draped lady. And before we leave this section of the store I wanted to show you this Moroccan stool. Isn't that just a neat piece? It is hand carved $479 and it's just amazing the things that they get from all over the world. And you can have a one-stop shopping here at B&B. &B. And let's take one last look at the furniture. 
before we go back over to fashion. And such a beautiful display on the silver plated square trays there. And now we're going to go back to their wonderful fashion accessories here. And that would certainly help you get Rodeo ready with that denim jacket. And everything is organized beautifully. And I'm looking at this brand here, Johnny Was. It's not something that I was very familiar with before, but I'm learning a lot today in this shop. And I'm liking the floral blouses too. Just something for every taste, style, and budget. And the classic blue and white. And the John Mark label. And a nice surprise here on the back. Didn't expect that. I might have to try this one on. $59, which is about half of retail. And that looks like an all-purpose blouse. Just love that look with the aqua. And I am partial to blue and white. And they've got some great jeans. It's definitely better than shopping a retail store. You're saving lots of money and you have an amazing selection. And this might look good with that John Mark blouse. We'll have to give this a try. And you'll see the Lily Pulitzer dresses that they have in the window. It's definitely a wonderful shopping experience for fashion. Johnny Was is modern boho chic. It's a company that started in sunny Southern California by Eli Levitt. And it is definitely a women's lifestyle brand that is trending. And they actually do have some flagship stores. A classic blue and white John Mark blouse with a bit of a surprise. I like the wired collar. This is a brand that is sold at Dillard's and it's usually about $129 for a blouse. And the price here at B&B is $59. You could be chic on a budget. A great example of Johnny was that signature embroidery, that great bohemian spirit. This handbag is very well priced at $34. That would be cute with jeans and a white t-shirt. You could definitely change your outfit and add some panache with this affordable handbag. Here is a look at what I'm taking home today. Just love consignment shopping and I'm delighted to have found the Heise Glass Company pieces along with the hidden gems, Waterford Crystal. These will be great additions to my tabletop collection, or perhaps I could even use a few of these for gifts for family and friends. I've had such fun at B&B Consignment. Thanks for coming along with me today. And you see the Jim O'Leary flute that is very special. Some great deals on the Heise glass and some hidden gems. Thanks again for joining Lady Mary Beth. Elevate your everyday with consignment shopping.